everybody welcome to get ready with me Louise so we're gonna be doing this eye look today using the last palette in the Viseart um, collection the petite four this is the Rosa Rose Lotus palette comes in this in this and again like the other three opens up don't get me started I would love to know what the art is doing over there. I don't get it. And it's my money I'm wasting, okay? Let's get started. This is what the palette looks like. The first shade we're going to go into is this one right here. Y'all. Okay. That's how much I have on this, okay? Ready? Are we ready? Can we see? Yes, we can see. Okay. I mean, I don't even know what to say to that. I really don't understand. Because Busy Art can do eyeshadow like no other. They really can. And I don't know what they're going for here. The only thing I can come up with is like the no makeup makeup kind of looks. Where it's very minimal in pigment in... The color selection like it just has not it they all have a nice gradient effect but it's so light it's just like a wash and for the price I mean I don't know I mean I, I'm trying to look at this from different perspectives in my collection we're gonna go into this shade here which is the darkest I'm trying to look at this as in who who would want this? And traveling wise, they're great. These little palettes are amazing to travel. Okay, they're little, they're compact, they're easy to, to travel with, they're easy to put in, you know, you can put it in anything for that matter, your purse. You can drop it. But I'm trying to build this up as best as I can, seriously. But I just don't know what it's given anybody. I really don't. Other than like I said, the no makeup, where you just want a little bit of something to make it look like you're, I'm going back into that first shade, to make it look like there's something there. Because, of course, when you are on vacation, I do, we're going to take that same dark shade I just used and put it on the lower lash line. I do understand, like, you don't want to take that much time to do your makeup, you know? It's almost like a one and done type of shadow in a way. And I can understand that part of it. But if that's the case, you just came out with two collections back to back that are like that. Now, the first collection, they did come out with the blushes. And like I said, you know, at least you do get to try both their blush and their eyeshadow formula. And some of their blushes can be used as eyeshadow. So I do. I can see it even though I still suggest no no but I can I can I can't even see it y'all I can't it's so disappointing because I really do like busy art like so much I'm wearing the Tarte fake awake um, liner in my waterline like I just I am dumbfounded by this to be honest we're going to go into this shade right here and we're going to put it on the lid there's no fallout I'm not going to spray it and that's a pretty color Again, if you're looking for just, but the thing is, is with this, is if you're looking for a wash, a color, you already have that in your collection, so I don't understand why they're bringing these out, I guess. I mean, in a way, taste test, I get that, but they should have brought their best then to taste test. We're going to go into this lightest shade right here. We're going to put it on the inner corner, and to me... The only palette that stands out again out of these three is that one, the Water Lotus. And like the other one, the other set, when they came out with the 
the last collection, there again was only one that stood out in that one that would work for me in the way I do my makeup. So I'm just at awe. And I'm really, I'm going to put the Gucci mascara on the top lashes. I'm really wondering if, like, I really don't want to buy any more from Viseart. Now that they've launched two collections, and I don't understand. It's not giving me what they usually give me, you know? And like I said, if it's just a wash, I guess I can see it. If you're on vacation, you're not going to take that much time to do your makeup for the most part. Now, if you're going out to dinner or going out to shop or something, then maybe. But if you're just going to the pool or the beach, I get the wash. But you don't have to buy these to get that, you know. You can just take your a colorful palette and just use your neutrals in it or something, you know. That's why I decided to use my Gucci mascara because it's kind of like a natural type of look it gives you. I mean, it's black as black, though, don't get me wrong. I wish they come out with a brown like this. That would be nice. But I don't get it, you all. I'm really... Be, I mean, I'm being honest because I don't want anybody to buy this and be disappointed. Because you would be. And this is not Viseart's best. I really... They got their cashmere palette, which I adore. Their Paris one, I adore. Like, they just got so many that I adore that I'm like, what are you doing here? What are we doing? I'm trying to get those separated. And it's just not working for me. Might have to separate them with a comb. There we go. I think maybe I got it. Or something there's not much I can do with this look to be honest I mean it, it's pretty basic pretty darn basic if you ask me and is there anything wrong with that no there's not nothing wrong with basic I am all for a basic look trust me on that but not from Viseart not like this anyway I mean, it's kind of as good as it's going to give. I don't know. What do you all think about these palettes? Did you buy them? Did you even notice them? I mean, Viseart's on my radio, radar. That's how I, you know, notice them. But, I just don't, I just don't know. This is what the palette looks like overall. Again, it's basic. I get that part. But, it's just a little too basic, maybe. Maybe that's what it is. I don't know. So who do I think this is for? It's going to have to be for someone who barely does any kind of anything. But wants a little bit of something. And like I said, the water locust. The, the, we got the Soraka, Suruku, Lotus, 
water lotus and the rosé lotus again easy to store easy to travel with out of them I would have to go with the water lotus being my favorite just because it is different in my collection but that doesn't mean that it's not different for it's not going to be different for everybody because everybody has different colors in their collection and what they use usually work with but that would be something different for me um the other two dime a dozen dime a dozen so i mean it's not that it's not pretty you can see it is a pretty look you know it gives you a little bit of something but that's all it's going to give you is a little bit of something and i got mascara all over why didn't somebody tell me all right there at least it came right off all right oh i got nothing over there okay perfect so it does give you a little bit of something but that's about it so that's all i have for you today i hope you enjoyed this video it wasn't very wow because the look's not wow but it's mm, you know so it's up to you with this collection i hate to say it i'd skip it i really would in the the last one i would skip unless you're interested in like the blushes maybe and you're not sure but you're not and you're not sure you're not sure, then maybe i could see you going for that but i'm 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 disappointed I am I'm disappointed in it and I'm and it's a shame because like we work hard for our money you know we want to buy stuff that we're gonna be happy with and it's not that I'm not happy with it it's just that it's not I'm not gonna pick these back up again other than maybe the water one I would maybe pick it back up if I was wearing something that shade the other two not at all and I was thinking about it. They are magnetic and you can remove them and put them in a palette. But then you take and create your own. But then you make take the risk of, for me, not knowing what the shade is and what palette it belongs to. If I did that and traveled with it or something, you know. So, I don't know. I mean... I'm at a loss for this, really, I am. Because I hate being disappointed. But, what can you do? You know, you win some, you lose some, I guess. Um, but that's all I have for you today, like I said. Um, I just, it's a no. I wouldn't do it, I just wouldn't. But, that's all I have yet again I'll say it again because I just I have no words to be honest because I'm just so disappointed and I mean in all honesty I think it's what $75 that's just down the drain I gave them $100 for nothing basically and that disappoints me it's one thing if I give them my money and they're like it's just not my shades because I kind of know that from the beginning you know but when it's something you're expecting and you're like that could be darker and it would work like, if that was a darker outer corner, it would work for me, and I'd be okay. That's perfect. I can deal with that, you know? But, I don't know. Again, if you're looking just for a wash of color, then maybe this is it for you, you know? But, um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, ring the bell, hit all. That will notified when I upload, I upload every day but Sunday. And I'll see you in the next one. Until then, stay safe and stay healthy. Bye.